Happy Sunday morning, friends. I guess it's not even morning anymore. It's like 1230. It's kind of like morning these days. Um, Sundays are my day for community, sangha, right? And also um, for poetry. I try to read it pretty much every day, but on Sundays I try to delve into a little bit more and feed my soul. Uh, and so I have seen this poem a few different times throughout my life and it came back to me again and I was like, oh yeah, this is totally a poem for now. Um, so I'm going to encourage you to Sit up tall and consider closing your eyes. You don't need to see me. This is about listening to these words and letting them hit you however they do. So maybe sit up tall and close your eyes. Turn on that listening, right? That deep listening tool of yours. And this is The Peace of Wild Things by Wendell Berry. When despair for the world grows in me, and I wake in the night at the least sound, in fear of what my life and my children's lives may be, I go and lie down where the wood drake rests in his beauty on the water, and the great heron feeds. I come into the peace of wild things who do not tax their lives with forethought of grief. I come into the presence of still water, and I feel above me the day blind stars waiting for their light. For a time, I rest in the grace of the world and am free. And again, that is The Peace of Wild Things by Wendell Berry. Maybe you keep your eyes closed and you stay right here in this state that you're in. If you're really liking that and do a little mini meditation. Hunter and I. Goodbye.